Hello, it's the Pineapple Guy. Today is uh, part 1.2 of the uh, Barn Find Project Car series. I did, I don't know if it was the game or if it was me that accidentally did it, but my pro entire progress for the game was um, kind of restarted. So I've just gone into sandbox mode and picked this um, super bird out of the junkyard, and I think we can restore this thing. I don't think I can even attempt to start this thing up now, but the idea for this episode at least is to just start rebuilding the engine. So, um, I guess to start and just uh, put in maybe the pistons would be good. I don't know if there are special ones though. Okay, they're not. We'll attach these and then build the engine off of that. Okay, so I just, just realized that I am attaching these pistons to a non-existent, to a completely worn out block, so I'm gonna undo the work I've just done so far and um, put a new block in here. Okay, I'm gonna see if I can buy a new block and move this thing over to the lift. Okay, I've purchased the block for a low price of $1,500. So I'm gonna get this thing onto a lift, so I can actually um, remove the thing. I have learned from uh, last ep uh, last episode um, how to remove the crankshaft and stuff, which um, now uh, by the way I do I do recognize that I did call the crankshaft a camshaft about five thousand times, and I may or may not do that here, so. Yeah. Move that, and I can take this off the lift. Like so, and remove the block. Okay, let's put this thing together. I'm gonna need a new one of these. I should realize I'll need a new one of everything. So I'll buy the uh, crankshaft and transmission bits right now. All right, let's uh, see if this stuff all goes back together, or see if I ordered the right part. Okay, so I did buy the wrong. I did buy the wrong transmission. So. Um, and sell this. But I just realized I have infinite money, so I don't need to. There we go. Now this is the correct gearbox, and I can actually put this thing together. Hey, now the car's down, I could work on putting the, suspend uh, the pistons in. Actually, no, I can't yet. Oh, wait, no, I can. So there we go. Oh, yeah, I need new engine. Uh, Engine head over about the ah, I get it, I get it. Okay, I did order the wrong. I need an engine head B for this side. There we go. T 
two exhaust manifolds coming up. All right, looks like this whole engine's about to be orange. Get an intake manifold. Okay, I got the correct manifold. So it's gonna. Yeah. Wow, it's got triple carburetors. Guess I need three of those now. Okay, let's see if I got the right stuff. Right, so uh, this engine's looking pretty good. I think I'll just um, keep it on a time lapse and put on the finishing touches here. All right, this uh, engine looking it's looking like it's almost done here. Just gonna take a peek around to see if there's anything else I need to do, other than the exhaust, because I I know I need to work on it. Okay, I think I'll need head covers. All right? Yeah, exhaust. Okay. So, um, I'm gonna get some head covers and put those on, and I think I'll be, um, pretty, pretty much done. Okay, I just realized that I need, uh, some valve push rods, so I'm gonna get those. This is gonna be a pretty, um, boring process, and I ordered the wrong ones. Okay, so it turns out there's a. Uh, seems like there's two for every cylinder on this engine, so I'm gonna need eight more. Okay, with those on, now I need uh, rocker arms and uh, spark plugs. And, uh, spark plugs. Okay, so uh, that's uh, this cylinder bank done. Now just to finish this one. All right, so uh, this engine's looking pretty well complete. All I need now is a fuel filter. Alright, so that's, um, I think that, that does it for this episode. Uh, we got the engine and transmission completely rebuilt. So, uh, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.